they restock some of their flowers. Good morning, everybody. It is Friday, get excited. We have got practice early this morning. Usually, McCoy goes at 8.30 and then we stay and Merritt goes at 9.30. And Merritt usually helps out with the little, with Koi's age, like catching balls and stuff. But today they're scrimmaging, so we're both going at, they're both going at 8.30 to have a scrimmage and then we're done at 9.30, so that is exciting. <laughs> early morning. Um, and then this afternoon they have 4-H Astro Space Camp. So that will be happening this afternoon. Normally I don't dress up so much for baseball practice, but I thought I'd go ahead and get ready for the day since I'm going to run to Walmart and see what else I get into. But I just have some um, pretty purple tassels on and this little shirt with the ruffle sleeve. I think this is so cute from Walmart. Y'all, can you even believe? Uh, Y'all know I love a kind of a rainbow print, so I had to have this. It's just um, a cute little top. And then I do have shorts on, y'all. It's hot and mama needs to stay cool. I do not usually wear shorts, but I have been rocking them this summer. So, Anyway, I should probably have steamed this. It's a little, I put it in the dryer, but it's a little wrinkly yet, but it's fine just for running around. So, um, that's what's going on today. Come along with us for a fun Friday, y'all. I brought this eyeshadow palette out so, you could show, so I could show you what I wore today and I forgot to show you. It is just sort of like pinkies. Um, I don't know, can we see that? Um, super cute, this is Too Faced. Uh, you love to smell them, don't you? Oh, you found your cap. Good. Um, this is the Too Faced Watermelon Palette, and it actually smells like watermelon. Um, I'll open it up and show you which ones I wore today, but I love this palette, y'all. I guess he does, too. Like, yep, there you go. So I used um, this one, this one, this one, and this one. Kind of those pretty pinks, and then it smells like watermelon. So this is the eyeshadow side, and then this is the um, sort of highlighter, blush, and bronzer side that I haven't used, but it smells like watermelon too. All right, off to baseball. I am getting a lot of good, um, oh, there he is, that's my reading time um, during their practice. This book is so good, y'all. Oh, that's crazy. There he goes. <laughs> Okay, we are back from practice. My eye is twitching again, y'all. What is going on with this? Um, ooh. <laughs> also, I just remembered I finally did some nails again. These are the ones that I got on my trip. They were called Corally, Corally Crazy or something. It's those new ones that are just like colors and they're real short. I love them because I didn't have to like file them down or anything. And they totally match my shirt. <laughs> Score. Anyway. The boys are gonna go swim, they're dying hot. They had a big fun time at practice. That was good, it's fun to watch them um, and read my book. Um, so they're gonna do that. I need to do some saddle club kind of um, deposits and books and stuff, um, get all that ready because I need to take it to the bank and then we need to run by um, the barn and uh, I need to run by the post office and all that good stuff. I'll probably do that before I drop them off at camp so then I have more time while they're actually at camp. I think there's one in the bathroom hanging up drying. Your shark one um and then i told him we would go to mcdonald's for lunch because last time was that last week we were doing running around yeah it was last week when we went to the pool with their friends we went and got uh mcdonald's and they never want chicken nuggets and for some reason they wanted chicken nuggets and i feel like i ordered it or maybe I didn't, I don't know, but they got cheeseburgers instead and they've been wanting chicken nuggets since then. So I said we would do that today for lunch. So that'll just be easy lunch. Um, and then I'm hoping tonight to do some BLTs. I've got a little bit of my Wonder Bread left and I've been making bacon, making bacon in the air fryer and it's so handy. It makes the whole house stink, but I mean, it's bacon. So I thought I might do that tonight. Um, just for an easy supper. And they did just see that the new Disney movie, what's it called, Coy? Lucas? Luca? Luca, the new Disney movie Luca is on Disney Plus, like free streaming, I guess. I don't know. They may have paid for it. I don't know what happened, but I feel like that dragon one took forever to go free, to be free on Disney Plus. Anyway, we're going to watch that tonight and have like a movie night with popcorn. So um, that'll be fun too. So we can just have like an easy supper. So that's what we'll do for supper. But for now, I need to get my Saddle Club stuff done. Okay, got all my banking prep done. Now I'm gonna work a little bit and get some clothes folded before we head out for the day. Okay, change of plans. Um, one of the gals that's putting on this little camp is like an intern for um, 
4-H for the summer, and she's one of our horse show friends. She babysits the boys, um, and she had time to meet us for lunch. We're gonna go to Culver's and actually eat lunch there, and then they'll go to the camp, and then I'll do my shopping and my running around. P.S. I don't know if we mentioned, we are still absolutely loving the car. We're trying to keep it clean, y'all. We're doing pretty good, so that's nice. Um, yeah, it is, I have had no complaints whatsoever. In fact, every time I drive it, I think, oh my gosh, I love this car so much. <laughs> anyway, we're heading to lunch. Yummy Culver, say hi, Jill. <laughs> McCoy, what'd you get? Uh, strawberry. Merritt, what'd you get? We all know you got cookies and cream. Okay, y'all, we are done eating. Um, Jill just went ahead and took the boys with her to camp. Um, it's a little bit early, but she has to set up and they can help out and stuff. So they are gone. I'm here at the post office. Um, I need to buy some stamps and check the PO boxes and all that. I'm gonna run to the bank. I'm gonna run to the barn and then I'm going to Walmart and I'm gonna walk down every aisle and enjoy every second of it. All right, y'all know I gotta check out the nails, see if they got anything new. I feel like I should do red for 4th of July. How cute are these little terrariums? We've done these before and the boys absolutely loved them. So cool. Oh, there's like a little tomato cilantro growing kit, a mushroom growing kit. So many fun things. Looks like they restocked some of their flowers, but I have both of these. I wish they had that sunflower one. It's so cute. It was so nice this morning. Now my thermometer says 101 and I have ice cream in the back and I have 20 minutes before I pick up the boys. So this should be interesting. I kept telling myself, put my coal bags in the car, put my coal bags in the car. I forgot. Anyway, I got way too much stuff in there. I needed a lot of staples. Um, I'll show you the fun stuff when we get home. Um, I don't know what we're gonna do if they were gonna wanna swim because it's so hot or relax or what, but when we get home, I'll show you this stuff and we'll regroup and figure out what's gonna happen the rest of the day. Okay, I got the nuggets, we're heading home. They had so much fun. There's slime, there's rockets, there's a whole, they got these whole crates full of more activities to do. So we're heading home to unload the car. I got all the wheat it's nailed heat. over there and it's now, heat. Is it wheat? It's wheat, isn't it? I it's, think it's wheat. I can't get this up. There's like road construction up here. Um, he got all the wheat bailed. I hope um, that I got a picture of that. And then he's gonna plant sorghum in the field that um, he cut the wheat in. Always doing something, y'all. Okay, we are home. Oh my goodness. Um, they were just chattering away about the camp and how much fun they had and all the fun things they did. I feel like my eye keeps like twitching wide open and it's like Bleh. okay sorry it's doing it right now it looks so weird i don't know what is going on with it anyway it did this it had done this like the last week of school and then school ended and i went on vacation and it quit and now it's doing it again i guess now i'm back to stress out anyway i'm gonna show you what i got um they had so much fun at camp and i'll show you the rest of their little stuff i don't know if there's like I know there's more activities, but I don't know exactly what it is. Am I focused? Um, okay, let's see. First of all, I got, um, oh my, my dirty dishes, as always. We needed a new trash can. It goes over here. That red one has seen better days, so I just got this kind of, uh, it's not really turquoise, it's kind of a blue color. This is for Craig's Father's Day gifts, which I'll show you those too. Um, it has this like lid. It's just a hefty that um, pops open. I don't know if we'll use the lid or not. My other trash can had a lid and just never survived. Anyway, I got that. Um, I haven't put this stuff away yet. Just some pepperoncinis. This is what I use for my Mississippi roast and chips because I did get some of that queso that I got for Koi's birthday party. I can show you that. Not to do tonight, but to do it sometime. And then just some, we were out of crushed tomatoes, diced tomatoes. I like to use this when I make um, my chili, which I actually made last night. And then I needed um, onions. Hang on, let me show you the queso. This is the queso, y'all. Uh, I don't know how to pronounce that, but it's amazing. You mix it with milk and you heat it up and it tastes so good. Okay, so now my fridge is full. I put all the staples away, so that feels amazing. So let me show you what's out here so that I can get it put away. I try to get a lot of fresh fruit because that's Koi's favorite. We had gotten an influencer box one time with this Zespri sun gold kiwis and the boys loved them and i have not been able to find them anywhere and they had them there today so they were really expensive they were like eight bucks but there's a bunch of them in here and they loved them and actually i liked them too but i'm pretty sure i'm not supposed to have them but maybe i'll just have one but um you just sort of cut it and then eat it with a spoon and it was so good so i got those i got some raspberries and i got some strawberries y'all know our faves 
bananas. Uh, I got some avocados. I've been dying for some avocado toast. Um, so these will have to get ripe and then we'll have some of those. I did get the tomatoes. This is all I had for tomatoes. So uh, I don't know if even the boys will eat one, but Craig and I will. And I got the um, lettuce and then I just went easy and got the fully cooked bacon. We can do it in the microwave to have the LTs tonight. I did get some of these real bacon pieces so that we could do, um, it's like that cracked chicken with like, it's like uh, shredded chicken or, or like frozen chicken. And then you do cream cheese and this uh, and mix it all together and you put it on buns or I just eat it plain. But I was going to make that. So I needed some bacon pieces. I was just in the mood for some macadamia. So I got those. This is the part of Craig's Father's Day. He loves all this gummy candy stuff. This and then some nutty buddies that will all be for his like father's day gift to go with the other stuff we got also got some cherries i had gotten those the other day when they had friends over and we had a barbecue and they were a huge hit with all of the boys so i got some more of those we need some more salsa i just grabbed that i needed some more pickles so we can make pickle chips um keto pickle chips those are so good i have got a kind of fun little surprise coming next week that we're going to use these um popcorn kind of buckets with so you have to stay tuned for that i got some frozen pizza because y'all know that's life i did get a bunch of fruit this really needs to get in the freezer it's so hot here um to do smoothies i thought they might like this tropical blend they don't love mango so much but i thought with the pineapple and the other stuff they would like it so we'll see good standby strawberry banana they love that and then they love this and i kind of like this one too um the berry medley so i got that i have not tried this but i thought like it would be something that coy would like peach strawberry lemonade bubble fruit and it's like it, does it have like little bubbles in it i don't even know why it's called bubble fruit but i saw somebody else hauling it the other day and i thought it might be fun so we'll give that a whirl of course y'all know how to get bang i got the cherry vanilla black cherry what is this called black cherry vanilla just to have on hand because <laughs> summer is a lot um i did against my better judgment get more of these i had not gotten any since like february since merit like almost burnt down the house with one but it's summer and these are so quick and easy so i got a few of those y'all they had keto buns at my walmart i don't know keto culture i might do my blt on this tonight to give these a whirl and see how they taste this is not the same brand that my girlfriend was getting me at um where was she getting those at Costco? But I mean, I had got them right there in town and they were easy uh, just to get and I didn't have to go because our Costco is really far away. So I thought if these will work, that is a great upper, you know, opportunity. That is a great uh, option for me um, to be able to get them at Walmart. So I did get two, I'll freeze one and then have one just open. Um, and then somebody had shared these on Instagram or youtube the other day and y'all know how much i love the black and chicken strips from popeyes and so i thought this was kind of like a similar deal you know y'all i didn't even check to see the car oh no it only has one carb so that's fine i was like oh my gosh these things have a bunch of carbs and i got two bags i'm gonna be so sad but they're supposed to be really good like dipped in ranch or with a salad or with a um tortilla wrap so i got a couple bags of those i'm excited to try that then i got some other um shirts and clothes and stuff let me put all this away and then i'll show you that okay i did get a couple of these crates they're really pretty kind of aqua color i'm gonna put one outside for like corralling goggles and all sorts of swim stuff out by the pool and the other one i'm gonna put all of my tropical plates and napkins and all the stuff that i had out for like tableware and stuff i'll show you um just to kind of corral it and then maybe I can keep it in the garage for easy access so i got a couple of those i did get a couple of these just like little cheap 8x10 frames to put their baseball picture in. I'll show you that in a second. Um, they got those in. I grabbed a pair of shorts. I don't know if these are going to fit or if I'm going to like them. But I'm into shorts and I saw them. And they had a black pair that I really wanted but they didn't have my size. So if these fit, I'm going to order a pair of black to go with something I'll show you in a second. They had the cutest jammies, y'all. If you follow me on Instagram, you know I have seen these before. Um, they have just a kind of cute little wide leg with like a little... Um, cute little trim around the bottom i thought that was so cute but they have a really pretty rainbow stripe set but they still didn't have my size i'd shown them on instagram a couple weeks ago in fact it was more than that it was like a month ago but i thought these tropical ones would be cute for summer so i got the pants they're just kind of like a little i know i'm not showing you very where yeah very well maybe i'll put them on later but it's just a little capri pant and then the little shirt is just almost like a little t-shirt but it has the same like um a detail around the edge kind of like a little edging and it's just a little short sleeve Let's see if i can show you this just a little short sleeve kind of shirt that goes with it and it's super soft so i did grab that that brand was oh let's 
see, Secret Treasures, the same as my Fabulous Lounge World that I love so much, and each piece was $9.97, so I did grab that, and then these next two shirts are the same as the, um, the plaid one that I got on vacation and I had to exchange it for a smaller size, and then I ordered this black and this one too, this tropical print too, and then they got back ordered and then they canceled my order. So I did get the plaid one, which I love, but I didn't get these other two, and I thought these were so cute, and just like a pretty black ruffle staple kind of piece, um, a shirt to wear all summer. So I got that, I was so excited they had my size in my actual store, so I grabbed those. Um, I got the black, I just think these are so stinking cute, and it's like everything I love, a ruffle sleeve, a circle hem, um, like come on it's so cute um so i did get this um sort of tropical one too i might bring this to vegas we're going on kind of a girls um overnight uh at like a casino resort pool situation i might wear this there or just wherever i don't know it's just cute for summertime it can be casual or um dressed up so i got that um and then i showed you the shorts yeah is that oh i got um i showed you the wrapping paper i got just a little bow thing to put on his present i got some more tape because our our states fell off <laughs> the tape i had used the other day it was not good enough so i had to get some new we are going through sunscreen like crazy i think i just said the boys are back in the pool now i hope that they have sunscreen on because there wasn't much left um so i got some more of this and i can use this too i really prefer to wear the um neutrogena 100 but i've noticed that i can pull off the 50 and then get just a little bit of color i did a tan last night so this isn't really like my actual color but I can use this and not get like my sun rash my sun allergy or whatever and still um, get a little color so I've been doing that a little more and then I did get honeysuckle and pineapple lily wax cubes this is actually a little wax melt over here and I needed something to put in that one and then scissors we had taken our kitchen not our kitchen scissors but our household scissors out to the horse trailer and they never made it back in so we needed more scissors okay oh my gosh that was a lot let me see there's women out here being crazy I don't know if they put sunscreen on or not. I better go check. I did look for them some more floats. They had a big old zebra float, but it was like $20. And I mean, we're on the farm, y'all. And we've already lost one alligator. Well, it's in the garage. Maybe it just needs to be blown up. I don't know if it's like broken or what, but it's hard to spend a ton of money on floats when like they blow away or they get popped or they get left out or whatever. So I didn't buy many floats today. I don't know. Um, Honestly, I had three hours to be in Walmart and I was like just in time to pick them up. So <laughs> I walked down every aisle and enjoyed myself, which was nice. But um, okay, what do I need to do now? I need to do a thumbnail. I need to do a thumbnail for Monday's video that's going up Monday for Wednesday's video. And I need to, oh, I want to show you Craig's Father's Day pres presents. Let me do that before he comes inside. <laughs> Okay, y'all, he has been having so much fun with the boys' BB guns and helping them shoot and everything since they got those at Christmas. And so I found him the adult Red Rider. <laughs> like, it's the adult size BB gun. And so I think he will get a kick out of that. So we got him this for Father's Day. I did not tell the boys because I didn't know if they could keep a secret and I wanted him to be surprised. So I got him that from Amazon. I can link it under Outdoor Fun, I guess. Um, and then this I will link. I guess I'll link this in household, but it had like a million five-star reviews. And no, maybe not five-star, but really high reviews. And it's like a car vacuum. You know, we got the new car and we're trying to keep it, keep it clean. And he likes to keep his truck clean too. Um, so I was looking for one and this one came up as the best. So that's what we got. It's got a really long cord and you hook it up to the... I always call this a cigarette lighter. I'm a child of the 80s, but whatever you call that cord... <laughs> A, yeah, look, it's a cigarette lighter right there. See, I'm right. Anyway, and it's supposed to be really good just to kind of like vacuum your car if you have messes and you can, it's small enough where you can just like store it in the car. And so like, if there's a mess, like the boys make a mess while we're on a road trip, they can just clean it up right there and then. So this is kind of a gift for both of us, really for the whole family, but I just thought I'd give it to him for Mother's Day. So I'm going to spend a little time here and wrap these up and then go hide them back in the closet that way they'll be done because like I said we have the concert to go to tomorrow and I have to um our baseball team the fifth and sixth graders are playing in a tournament at our field like our team is putting it on um our town and so I have to like work the concession stand tomorrow for a couple hours. I don't know if the boys will go with me or not because obviously they're not playing. They're not old enough. So I have to do that tomorrow and then the concert. So tomorrow is going to be like a wash for me to get anything done. So I probably should do this now so that he can have them um, on Sunday for Father's Day. So I'm going to do that now. All right. All done. And I'm ready for Sunday morning. Now i got to go hide them because he might guess what this long thing is if he sees it. All right, y'all. I know it's dark over here in this corner, but I am completely obsessed with this shirt. 
love it so much. It is so tropical and fun. I really think going down the size still gives it that oversized look, but it's not quite so potato sack on me. And the shorts, I don't know if you can see them. I totally love them. I'm going to try to get them in black because I think that would be so cute um, with this shirt and black and then like a really pretty um turquoise sandal that i have already that i think would be so cute and then i've paired it with these huge mama jama turquoise earrings or i could do um my kendra scott ones over here that are a little more understated i never thought i would call these earrings understated but when you put them up against these <laughs> they're a little smaller anyway I'm obsessed, y'all. You have got to get this top. It is so stinking cute. And there's lots more patterns and prints. There's a solid coral. Now, this I, I got the only two they had in my size today, but they have the plaid one that I already have, and they have this, and a black, which I got a white, a coral, and like five other, four or five other different prints. It's so stinking cute, and it's so like flowy and flattering, and it's got the big pretty sleeve, and it's just like casual summertime. Is this casual? I don't know. Let me try the black one on. Okay, and here is the black one. Of course, I can pair anything um, with it. I just think this is so stinking cute. A big pretty necklace, another big pretty earring. Um, even if I worked to Nashville to our kind of big cattle conference we're going to, I could have it with my new um, purse strap that I got that has the tooled leather with the black and all the different color flowers on it. This That would be cute with this too, just to kind of have like a base black shirt. I just love this so much, y'all. Terra Sky. At Walmart, get you one. <laughs> and because it's after five o'clock on a Friday evening, I went ahead and put my lounge wear on, y'all. Oh my gosh, these are so soft and they have pockets. Can you see the bottom? They're like a little capri. Oh my gosh, they had lots of print, y'all. I'm telling you, I want the rainbow one, but they had a tie dye pink and a couple of more like gray muted kind of not so bright ones and I don't remember what else I never did fix my hair today y'all I had it back this morning and I forgot to fix it anyway I love this so much oh so cute okay um I don't think I ever said but the shirts were $13.98 and those shorts which I'm gonna try to get the black pair were um $13.44 or something like that, which is a steal for a pair of shorts. And they were like the perfect length. They were like the 10 inch inseam Bermuda short from Time and True. I love them. Okay. All right. I'm going to put, <laughs> let me see what I can do next now that I'm all cozy. Um, all this stuff is over here on the floor. My plates and tropical stuff, I'm going to put it in one of those bins and get that done and then put their baseball pictures in the frames. Perfect fit. Now this is all corralled and together next time we have a little barbecue or want to eat outside It's all ready to go. And then if I get any more pieces, I've got some extra room too So that is good. I'm gonna see if I can find a place for that nice and safe somewhere in the garage So it's not like taking up space in the house and then this is gonna go outside by the pool I need to put these away. I need to Use this good tape and put that back on our Iowa and Wisconsin. This needs to go to the garage Oh baseball pictures all right, here we go. Aren't they handsome? Nothing special, just a little um, plastic frame so they could have these up in their room and be able to look at their friends and their teammates and stuff and just um, keep these nice. So hopefully nothing will happen to them. I hear a little swimmer coming in now. Oh my gosh, I was looking all over for Craig. He's in the pool. That's where I should be doing so hot, y'all. Also, I'm totally loving my little ottoman jaw. They are just perfect for out here. I do bring them back inside. I don't leave them out here just so they stay nice. This cat, y'all. Hi, Mavis. We don't know where the kittens are. Craig has seen them since we have. Just the orange one, though. But it's been a few days, so now we don't know what's happening. She won't tell us anything. Hmm. Will you? I don't know. I don't have high hopes, y'all. Every time. Next time she has kittens, I'm like canceling my vacation because every time she has them, we go on vacation. Actually, different cat. <laughs> She's never had kittens before, but every time we get kittens, we go on vacation and then can't find them afterwards. But She's still happy and healthy, so I guess that's all that matters at this point. She's hiding the kittens from us. I guess we'll just let her keep hiding them. Mavis. <laughs> If this doesn't say summertime, y'all, I don't know what is does. Everything is ready for the BLTs. Koi is having his um, kiwis. When they sent us um, some of these for Influencer, they gave us this little 
tool with the knife and the spoon. So you cut it and then you eat it. Can I have one? Yeah, you may, of course. I might have one too. They were so good. Um, y'all, I cheated and tried these. So, so, so good. I can't remember if they're as good as the other, but they're good and they're totally doable and I'm so excited about it. I just toasted me up one um, quick in the toaster so that I could have it uh, with my BLT. Let me see, Koi. They're like yellow. They're like yellow kiwi and you just eat them. Delish, huh? So good. <laughs> Mary, you can just use a regular spoon. Yummy. I just ate one of those kiwi, y'all. Totally off plan, but completely worth it. It's like, I don't even know how to explain it. It's um, not, um, you gotta get them. It's look, called, um, it's Mom. Zespri. Zespri kiwis. Mom. And they're like yellow inside. Mom, Mom, would you, I have would you eat two, two of those kiwis for upper? Would you? Or one hamburger. Ooh, I like hamburger too, but it's like. I love the kiwi. I can't think of what fruit it tastes like, but it's not as tart as kiwi. It's more sweet. I don't know, y'all. Try them and let me know what you think, because they're amazing. Okay, I'm going to make my BLT, and we're going to watch. Luca! <laughs> All right, my yummy BLT is ready to go. Um, I did have one last bag of Mahalo chips. I just ordered some more, so hopefully they'll be here soon, because I'm obsessed with these. We are gonna get our sandwiches ready and go watch the movie. Okay, they're all getting their sandwiches ready. I went ahead and got mine ready. Um, I'm gonna end this one here. I hope that it was long enough. I'm sure that Walmart haul was pretty long, but um, Bye, we had a fun, busy day. I'm excited to watch Luca because I love a good Disney movie. So we are gonna do that. Got a busy weekend ahead, but we'll be vlogging more next week. Thanks so much. For following me along subscribe to my channel so you don't miss a bit of our summer fun and we'll see you in the next one hopefully with a better behaved children <laughs> bye y'all